Please stop pacing and sit down. Why does he always What do you remember about recording for Dr. Katz? And I know it was a while ago. Mm-hmm. I'll tell you. Um, it was a while back, and I know... Um... Oh, that's plenty. <laughs> We're out of tape. Yeah, it was a while back. <laughs> it was a cold day, and... Uh... It was up in Boston, so I remember I um, had to come all the ways up there. I think I actually had to pay for the trip. I'm not exactly sure. I'll make a note of that. Okay. okay. And uh, I remember it was really an honor to be asked um, the fifth season after Ray Romano had done it about 29 times. So um, I felt really, really, it was cool. And it was already a big hit. So you know, you aired, you aired in the first season. I did? Yeah. Okay. Okay, so so what what else do you remember about? So you came up to Boston, then and then, did you spend the night? Yeah, um, I believe I did stay in the night on your couch. No, uh, what happened is uh, I came up to Boston. I thought it would be this big elaborate studio, but it was like a guy's yeah. house. Was that your house? Yeah, that was Tom Snyder's house. We did the, the entire first season. We did in his pantry, which was like just a little room that he sealed off, soundproof, put mics in it. Uh, he had a couple of animators working there. Yeah, it was a very, it was a very mom and pop feel about it, you know. And uh, I remember uh, stepping outside for a smoke back then, you know. Right. Cigarettes didn't cause any disease, and um, it was a bright day. And I'm like, wow, this is really cool. I really don't remember much. Was it was it exciting? That was the beauty of of your show is that uh, it basically was kind of a comedic garbage dump of material. <laughs> Uh, Thank where you. we'd come in and then you yeah. uh, and we would do our acts you know, and you would uh, kind of give some asides. Right. And, some, and, uh, and people would come up and do hey here here are four the things that four things that never made anybody laugh. Why don't I say them now? <laughs> <laughs> that would be your um your performance artist types. Yeah. I think Dave I think the first season was when I took my role literally. Yeah, you I were actually, helping people. I actually thought I was gonna make you get better. I mean, right. help, I mean, help you get better. Uh, and then, you know, somewhere during the second season, somebody gave me permission to be funny. Right. But I just, I, I was, you know, I, the first season I made one woman cry. Mm-hmm. Just one? I made somebody actually feel better about themselves. Oh. And, and, and I bored a lot of people to death, including you, I think. Well... I mean, it might have looked like boredom, but I was using an acting technique called um, "When's my bus out of here?" <laughs> <laughs> oh, fake laughs all around. Now this was when it was on the Ha Network, right? Hey, do you remember that? You know, Doctor Katz was a rock and hit back on Comedy Central. The only other shows they had, which it's so different from the way it is now, was um, South Park, The Daily Show, and Kids in the Hall. Oops. Oh. <laughs> no, actually, they didn't have South Park yet. They, had, they didn't? They had Short Attention Span Theater, which was the predecessor to The Daily Show. With really? John Stewart was the host of that. Right. They had uh, Strangers with Candy. That was funny. Um, and then they also had a show called... Called We Bought It Overseas and It's Pretty Cheap. Yeah. <laughs> And to this day, the animation that you guys did, whether that was uh, uh, drug-induced or whatever, is still, you know, still pretty kick-ass, man. You did it. Was that your vision? Like you wanted to look kind of squiggly, like a meth? No, that was that was the vision of that was the vision of Tom Snyder because he he invented that form of animation, yeah, in his in his basement. So he's kind of the Walt Disney on a very small scale that didn't really kick kick in. I I'd like to think of Walt Disney as as a guy as a as a Tom Snyder Jr. In his will, he asked to be frozen. Boy. Mm. Talk about dream the dream. Wow, that's good stuff. <laughs> is your Indian name random facts? No, but is, is, is my goal... To, would you rather freeze in eternity or rot in hell? I'd rather rot in hell. I'd want to get it over with. I really... I just want to get it done. That's a good, that's a great guy, question, though. This one crazy guy. Mm-hmm. He's just laughing at an empty juice container. He's just laughing at it. And he sees me looking at him, so he goes, jealous? And you know something? I was a little jealous. What is the secret, crazy? 